Welcome to my channel, Planet Mother's Ready. I'm going to be doing a Target haul. Uh, more things I got from Mother's Day. So, this is from my daughter, playing with Jackie. I only have one child. So, let's get into this video. I'm going to actually bring the bag down. I think it'll be easier. You're probably going to hear a lot of rattling. Well, this is one of the items. I do apologize for this noise. Um, take that. It's for receipt. She always ends me, leaves me with a receipt. Okay, so it is cleaning, um, electronic, kind of makeup, and a like bag. Okay, so let's get started. I'm going to try to organize this a little bit better. Okay, so I will start with the makeup first. Oh no, you know, I'll start with the planning first. It's only one item. So I've seen this there, and it is a list pad. It's going to be hard to see, and it's January through December, and then you have your days of the week. So it's a list pad of your month and your days of the week. So let me show you that. And in here, it's got like Sunday, your breakfast, your lunch, your dinner, your snack, and it goes Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Um, was, yeah, Saturday. I forgot I said Sunday. And then a shopping list. So all the days of the week say the same thing. Your breakfast to your dinner, and then your shopping list of anything you have to buy for the week. So every page is like that. It's all the same. So that is the UPC. Uh, let me put it this way. And then this is what it looks like. So you get 40 sheets. So that's 40 months. Because this is a week worth of, not 40 months. So 40 weeks, not, I don't even know what I'm saying here. 40 weeks, just annoyed right now, from Sunday to Saturday. So it's Sunday, again, through Saturday. You have your meal tracking. So you can A5 punch this. Or somehow fold it into a personal planner or whatever. I don't know how you would want to use it. You could probably personal plan it or something and just fold part of it down. I don't know. So I think A5 would probably be best. Or you could attach the sheets and make it into a traveler's. I could do that as well. But I'll see how I like it. I, I like this though. It's cute. I don't know how the paper quality is though. Let's take a look at that. I don't want the video to be too long for you, but you know, I want you to have a nice video. Okay, so the paper quality is very thin, which is not bad, and they're all the same. So let me just show you closer now without the plastic. You're seeing the tripod, so I do apologize. Okay, so that is that one. I like it, it's a good deal. Okay, so now we're gonna go makeup related. Or cosmetic related, whatever you want to call it. Okay, so she needs these receipts. And I'm going to tell you what the makeup is. I think I lost my soda. Okay. So for the makeup. Okay, so the concealer was $6.39. I had a 20% off coupon, which brought it to 169. Well, I mean, took off 160. So your refund value was 566. And this is the Maybelline Facewear. So it's the concealer. It's new by the Face Studio. It is Maybelline though. The color is light medium. So I'm assuming that's my shade. They're not never open, so you can actually test it. And I don't like to open them unless they're already open. Okay, so the next one is the lipstick, this melting pout. And it is by CoverGirl. Okay, so which one is this one? I'm trying to see because she has two of them. Stick. 
trying to see which one this is. Here is the UPC. Let me try by the UPC 302. No, I have no clue. So it's six ninety nine. Um. So yeah, it was six twenty nine. I guess this one didn't have a coupon. Okay, so this is the number one hundred five. I'm just holding it in your face, and I do apologize. The EOS. Did she pick up two of these? It's the crystal. And this is in peach. And this was $4.99 each. Okay, so that's the EOS for your lips. The next item is the time to get fit activity tracker and for this one was I do not see it on here ten dollars so this one tells you you track your steps rechargeable battery keep your progress and it connects to your phone it's Bluetooth and then track calories, burn, distance, sleep, and steps. So it does track your sleep. Check your daily, weekly, and monthly progress. Sync and track data to your phone. Built-in rechargeable battery lasts up to five days and set alarms. And then you can just compatible with the Google Play and the App Store. And then it does have for the smallest size and the largest size. The UPC for that. The next item she bought me is this wet comb. So it's a wet brush. It's detangling comb. So when you're brushing your hair, when like when you're out of the shower, this is probably best. You unique tooth design that gently, easily glides through tangles. So it's a detangler. This one was. Uh, Three ninety nine. So this one was three ninety nine. And that is the UPC. And the last item she picked up is this bag. And it's a black book bag. So I'm gonna lift you all the way up. Hopefully you don't fall today. So this is very big for this. So regular price is $32.99. It was $26.39. She bought it for. Okay, so let me just show you the way it looks. It's like a leather like. It's not leather. It's like leather. Because I'm going to show you the back real quick. Because I need to show you the tag. So this is the tag. So you get an idea. And this is the name Universal Thread. So in the back, since we're here, you have your two long straps, which is adjustable. And it feels just like leather, but it's not. So you have your two mounts to like the bottom part here. And then it mounts on top here. So you can see it's coming out of here. As long as it's not broke. Which I never really chuck these and you should. And then you have the, the hook handle, so you can hold it here, or just as your backpack. Okay, so there's nothing else on the back but that. The sides are just, just a side. It looks like a pocket, but it's not. The same on the other side. So in your first pocket, it is in your front, it is a flap. So you have like your hardware pull tie. And then I'm going to just take all this stuff out. Okay, so in here, you have like a decent sized pocket. 
and it feels leather-like, but it's really not. I can't stress that anymore. Okay, so in here you have a the large pocket, of course, your book bag part that kind of like flaps over, as you can see. So it opens up. It smells like one. Well, it doesn't smell like one, but it smells like I don't know. I guess that's new. I'm just taking all of this. I wish they would do it at the store. They go inside to check to see if you stole anything, but they won't actually take it out the bag. Okay, so you have your flap, like again. So this is your zipper. Here is your zipper pull, which I'm going to deck this out. You have inside here. I'm gonna kind of like go like that with it. You have your logo, your zipper, which is a, I mean, you see my hand? It's really deep in there. Okay, it opens up pretty wide. <laughs> Not like you can see it that well. Black on black. So again, it is black on black. And then you have a pocket here and a pocket there. So this is a very pretty bag. The only thing that kind of gets me is the zipper. And it's not broke, it's just the flap that's inside. You have to literally kind of like tuck in. But other than that, it's a very cute bag. Like, see how it, it feels so squishy? Like, so it feels like the leatherish, but it's not. So, this is my haul. Please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share with your family and friends, comment below. As always, thank you for watching. Have a good, uh, good Friday tomorrow and have a good day and talk to you next time. Bye-bye.